A Twin City school district says that it believes more work needs to be done after a student went public showing racially insensitive text messages. We edited out some of the wording, but these are the texts that Centennial High School student Elena Yang says that she got in a group text from other students. The school is investigating. As Susan Elizabeth Littlefield shows us, students at the school have a bold plan to try and make change. Nestled on the outskirts of the city, Centennial High School sits in the Circle Pines area. It's where Elena Yang says she's gotten a painful education in life. It's been going on for so long, and I've it just like it's. I feel like it's normal because they kind of normalized it, and I'm just used to hearing it all the time. She says she has been called racially insensitive words for years, and recently got a barrage of hurtful words in a group text message with classmates. And they were just telling me that I'm useless and that I'm going to fail school, and that my dad should go back to Hong Kong, and the whole family can go with it. As mom, when you read through those messages, what did you think? Oh. Absolutely disgusting, heartbreaking. Elena decided to go public on Instagram, sharing the piercing words with the world. Why did you want to speak out? To show people that racism and bullying is real and that people do get away with it. A recent alumni told us she was also a victim to harsh words. I am very very upset about it. She's helped to organize a student and alumni walkout on Monday. Have you gotten a reaction from the school district? Absolutely. They are very supportive. Um, Principal Bruning, extremely supportive. The counselors have reached out. The district tells WCCO an investigation was conducted and appropriate disciplinary action is being taken. And what is your hope that comes from this? Um, to make people feel safe. Susan Elizabeth Littlefield, WCCO 4 News. The ISD 12 district also told WCCO that they recognize there are still issues and are committed to a plan to ensure that these issues are addressed. The school walkout is planned for Monday morning at 945.